Okay, welcome back to Bounce Around Charleston. And we're just excited today about the show. And now we're going to talk with Shakira Thierce, Marcus Clark, and Taylor Gordine about the United as One Dance Camp and Battle, Kayla Neese Center for the Arts. Did I get that right? Yes, you did. Okay, welcome <laughs> to Bounce Around Charleston. Thank, Thank you. you. Tell us about the camp. The camp uh, is coming up this Saturday, uh, July 23rd. It's 8 a.m. to 6 p.m. You know, that's my birthday. Really? Mm -hmm. I think you should come to the camp and battle. <laughs> <laughs> um, the coach from the Prancing Tigerettes okay. of Memphis, Tennessee, mm -hmm. We both came together and we said, you know what, it's too much going on in this world and we want to show the kids that battle is not just to battle and to just get excited about fighting or anything. Mm -hmm. Let's show how two teams that are rival teams can come together and put on a showcase for oh. the community. Okay, Marcus, as a director in transportation, she coach, what is your obligation? My obligation at the Kennedy Center for the Arts is the director of transportation, like you said. Um, I am responsible for all transportation, um, to and from competition, battles, or any needs that the girls need, they need to get to practice, or any other obligations of after school programs, you know. Um, that's my job to get them there. Okay. Um, and Taylor Gordon, personal assistant, what do you do? I do anything that's needed within the studio um, as far as with um, helping out with practices. If Shakira's not able to get there at the moment, I help out with Marcus. We get the girls together, we help them stretch, get them focused and centered in for the day and help them get ready to express their day. Okay, so Shakira, why was it so important to help these young people? Um, it started out uh, at the age of 24. Um, October 29th, 2012, mm -hmm. I saw at least nine girls that just wanted me to start a dance team. And I said to them, I said, well, how can we make this happen? And this lady who owned a hair store said that we could use her closet in the back. So I started out with nine girls in the back of a hair store. Mm -hmm. And for these nine girls, I was their role model. And I couldn't figure out, why am I your role model? Well, Shakira, I mean, you just look so cute and you just dress so nice. And I said, well, I can show you girls how to dance mm -hmm. and be cute and look so nice. Okay, so are you a dancer? Yes, I am. Mm -hmm. So where did you st how did you start? Well, I'm a natural born dancer, but I started training at the age of 20 in Sumter, South Carolina with the Caroline Center for the Arts. Mm -hmm. So then you found, so now these young girls come to you and some of them are from broken homes? Yes, they mm -hmm. are. Broken homes, some of them have been neglected. Some has which tried to commit suicide. And we've had this thing called pillow talks. Um, before every competition, we have a pillow talk and we do a war cry. Mm -hmm. And our war cry is to just pray and ask God to deliver us from whatever we are going through. And I found out that I'm dealing with a lot at the age of 27. Mm -hmm. Needless to say, I have a one-year-old, but then I have 20 students that I'm taking their burdens and taking it home with me, and I'm like, okay, I have to do something. And okay. So now, on July 23rd, what can we expect? On July 23rd, you can expect uh, a camp full of fun, um, children coming together, learning how to buck. I don't know if you guys are familiar with the Lifetime hit show, Bring It. With the dancing dolls? Mm -hmm. I know you've watched that, mm -hmm. you know? Mm -hmm. <laughs> well, um, so we'll be teaching them the proper way on how to battle and okay. how to construct yourself at a dance camp. So on July 23rd from 8 a.m. to 6 p.m. at the Alvin Community Center, yes. 2191 Santee Road, St. Stephen, South Carolina, registration $20. Yes. You're looking for young people ages 5 to 18 mm -hmm. and general admission is $10. So now th when we come that day, we're going to see dance competitions. You're, yes, you're going to see the campers uh, battle as well as and the Fierce Divas, my girls, battle the Prince and Tigerettes who are coming all the way from Memphis, Tennessee. Okay, so we want the community, the public to see uh, a little a little dance. Yes. So introduce the two young ladies for us and we're going to let them give us a little brief little show. Okay, uh, well you will be witnessing my Captain Denasia Swinton and my right hand Takara Gordine as they do a short snippet of our field show. 
Take it away, ladies. Okay, so that's a part of your Dancing Divas, huh? Yes. Okay, we thank you for your performance. We'll be right back after this break. <laughs> 